All right, for two months, my math class has been stuck on this problem. I, I don't know. All right, it's an inequality problem. This is what it looks like. All right very easy. Find the zeros for these nomials, right? It's plus 3, minus 2, plus 1. Put them on a number line. Got it? Now, Next up, I know this is going to be really hard, right? Plug in zero for x. Zero minus three. It's a negative number. Positive. Negative. So, zero on this number line will be a positive number, right? Now, this part's really cool. And it's just a pattern. The signs will alternate. The values of the signs will alternate on this number line. All right. Now this is the really cool part. These are the values. All right. You want a greater than zero. Greater than zero means positive. It's supposed to be negative. So circle that. Circle that. So, the values you want for x will be greater than negative 2 and less than 1 or x is greater than 3. Right there. That's a number line. Easy schmeasy. That way you don't have to write down all the equations that you usually have to. Such as uh, writing down all the nomials of x minus 1 is greater than or less than 0 and all that stuff. Just use, the, just use the number line. I'll save you time. And just stop frustrating the professor. I mean, just use the number line. 